Hello folks, my name is Luis Ciber Rocal, and on this episode I'm going to show you how to create and reclassify a slope raster using ArcGIS 10.6. Uh, if you like my videos, please consider subscribing to my channel. If you want to follow along um, the tutorial, you can find the data at bit.ly slash luisiberrocal underscore slope. So, we want to create a slope raster and then classify it based on a range of values in order to estimate what type of slope has the biggest coverage in the province of Cochle. Now, we're going to use this classification table. We have a range in degrees and our classification. From 0 to 1 degrees, we consider it flat. 1 to 3, we consider it slightly, sl slightly soft. From 3 to 5 is soft from 5 to 15, moderate, and anything above 15 is considered a strong slope. As you can see, I have already uh, opened my uh, DEM from Cochlear. So now the first thing I'm going to do is run the slope command on my DEM. Uh, we're going to look for the slope command. And we're going to use the slope command from Spatial Analyst. As our input raster, we're going to use DEM Cochlear. For my, I'm going to keep my default output uh, raster. I'm going to keep my output measurement as degrees. Uh, the method, we're going to keep it as planner, and our C factor is going to be 1. We're going to click OK. And as you can see, it added here my slope uh, raster. Now, what we have here is a raster that contains the sloping degrees for every cell. What we want to do is reclassify these uh, degrees values into the classification we showed in the table at the beginning. For that, we're going to use the reclassify tool. We're going to click on Reclassify from Spatial Analyst. Bring this all the way down here. As an input raster, I'm going to use my slope, DEM. My Reclassify value is a value. And uh, I'm going to use the ranges that are in my table, the table I showed you. Like I said, from 0 to 1, it's going to change all the values to 1, which would be a flat, 1 to 3, 2, 3 to 5, 3, 5 to 15, uh, 4, and anything between 15 and 63, which is the highest uh, value, would be 5. And if there's no data somewhere, it's going to reclassify it as no data. So you can see these ranges match with the table I showed you at the beginning of the video. I'm going to keep my output raster with its default name and I'm going to click OK. As you can see here, now I have a classification uh, where each cell has the value of the class. As you can see here, uh, this area here in, let's say, um, this could be like a blue, shows areas with very high slope, which is areas up, up here, which is, makes sense because this area has a lot of mountains. Now, in order to find out uh, what is the uh, coverage of, the, of our classification, we're going to click on Open Attribute Table. And if I want to know uh, what uh, classification has uh, the highest coverage? All I have to do is order this in descending order. As you can see, it's uh, the value of 4, which is moderate slope. A moderate slope is uh, the, the classification that has the highest coverage in Cochle. But it would actually be a little bit more useful if I could actually have the area of moderate slope. So what we're going to do is we're going to add uh, a field, I'm going to call it area, hectares, so use 
I'm going to use this type uh, double. I click OK. So now I have the count of cells. If I know the size of the cell, all I have to do is multiply the count by the area of the cells. In order to know the area of the cells, I'm going to close this a little while. I'm going to right click uh, over my reclassification. I'm going to click on properties. And on the source tab, you can see here's the cell size. It's a 50 by 50 meter cell size. So I'm going to click OK. Open attribute table. Right click over area. I'm going to click on fill calculator. And I'm going to tell it that I want uh, the count times 50 times 50 divided by 10,000 because there's uh, 10,000 square meters uh, in one hectare. So I'm going to click OK. And I'm going to do the sort descending. And as you can see, I have uh, 170,000 646 hectares of uh, moderate slope. Uh, that will be all, folks. Uh, thank you so much for listening. If you like my videos, if you want to keep up to date with them, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.